in extreme conditions, these animals are basically surviving. They only need what to eat to carry on to tomorrow. And consequently, they don't have the surplus energy which they would push into reproduction. When the conditions like drought persist too long, certain foods within the habitat of these gorillas disappear or dry up. Extreme conditions like flooding also affect their behavior. And in so doing, they push these mountain gorillas to restrict themselves in particular habitats as a way of protecting against these extreme uh, conditions. Gorillas largely depend on a fruit diet, so as the increased heat stress uh, ravages the areas where gorillas live, you can be sure that most of the fruiting uh, seasons are going to be disrupted and when they are disrupted, that means they won't be uh, providing the necessary fruit-based dietary requirements that the gorillas want. <laughs> 